Hey, what is going on, Madden family? We are here. I was not going to do a Team of the Week video. But then I was like, ah, maybe we should. So week three, Team of the Week, still the same. Uh, the format is its not going to change. We just got to come to grips with that. Christian McCaffrey, Micah Hyde. Not the players we necessarily wanted, but... In their own right, they're actually pretty good. Now, there's a couple really good budget cards in here. Uh, Xavier Howard is really good. Uh, he compares well to uh, Denzel Ward, as we see here. Denzel's just he's a little bit better. Not much. Uh, but Howard has better strength. He's a little bit taller. Uh, his catching, as you see, is a little bit better there. His tackle is better. Their jump, eh, it's the same. Uh, and then we get down here. Plus 14 block shed, nine pursuit better. So Howard, honestly, is the be he's the better card. He's just the better card. Um, but again, very nice piece. He's a little expensive. Uh, Calvin Ridley, of course, he deserved a card. Why wouldn't he? 90 speed on him. I don't like that his receiving stats are so bad. Um, but... Nonetheless, here we go. Look at him here. Rookie Premier, 92 agility, 90 speed, 90 excel. His next card is going to be amazing. Amazing. He's he's right he's his card is right going to be right there with Tyreek Hill speed-wise based on his overall. Which is kind of crazy. Um so let's compare him to the 83 Tyreek. That's probably the best comparison we can have to see how Calvin is going to progress throughout the actual game. Uh, just very similar. 56 run block is good. His jumping is kind of bad. Uh, his spin and his juke are real close to being good. So, again, his next card, or when he hits like a 90, he'll be really good. But, again, Calvin, nice, nice card. Eddie Jackson's a good, he's a good free safety. He's a good free safety. Very solid. His coverage stat's not quite there. None of the low cards are going to have good coverage stats. But... He probably would play well for Cap. And then we got Jakeem Grant, who is really fast at 92 speed. He's really fast. <laughs> he's going to be. He's a Cap goon. He's a Cap goon. Uh, and then let's go take a look at Hyde and McCaffrey themselves. Again, both cards, not that we wanted, but. They're they're good in their own way. Uh, McCaffrey is a great receiving back. Easily the best in the game. Uh, it's not even a question. Not even a question at all. Uh, he can really do everything. Uh, and that's going to keep his price a little bit high probably. Uh, so if we see him, yeah, he's a 90. But the speed, the excel, the agility, the catching. His break tackle's not really there. His trucking obviously kind of sucks. Um, but it's catching at 83. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. Spin and juke, both at all the thresholds. Very good. Uh, and then we're going to see his catch and traffic is 81. His route runnings are pretty good. He's, he's, he's pretty good. McCaffrey's pretty good. He's not who we wanted, but he's pretty good. And then Micah Hyde, who is... Honestly, a little underrated at 90. Uh, like, we look at his stats here, and he's kind of like Ed Reed. <laughs> Especially if you power him up. If you power Micah Hyde up, you can get him very, very similar to what Ed Reed brings to the table. Uh, so we see he's two agility, three speed, one acceleration faster. If you have Sprinter... You could actually get them to be the same speed because hides a power up. Uh, his acceleration would obviously be a little bit higher too. His agility is going to be minus one. The catching, 85 to 78. Again, that's pretty close. It's not that far off. Tackling, the advantage goes to hide. The jumping obviously goes to Ed Reed. Uh, and then we see here the block shed, 
similar. The pursuit, sim, that 92 pursuit is really nice. The play rec goes to hide. The man coverage goes to hide. The zone coverage, slight tick to Ed Reed, but if you power him up, they're exactly the same. Now where Ed Reed's going to beat him is hit power and the spectacular catch part. I kind of want to give Micah Hyde a try. <laughs> I, I don't know why. I don't know why, but I do. Um, especially if it means that I can, if I could get rid of Ed Reed from Micah Hyde. <laughs> I mean, okay, Micah Hyde is crazy expensive right now. Um, he shouldn't be. I used to have a Nat Micah Hyde. I don't anymore, of course. Um, <laughs> I just this he's he's not the worst card in the world at all. Uh, like he's not. <laughs> he really isn't. I can't believe I'm saying that. Um, let's go look at Micah Hyde's power up on my head here. I think I ha can pull my browser up here in a second. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold the phone. My head makes my computer die. Um, so don't die, computer. Come on. Don't die. Don't die. There we go. Micah Hyde, right? It's a little small, but you get it. So, if you power him all the way up, and we're going to bring up... I mean, just look, the card, it's not that, it's not that big of a difference. At all. And he doesn't have, like, crazy jumps that you need to do anything with. At all. I might try this, honestly. Am I going to be crazy enough to try this? <sighs> I might just be crazy enough to try this. Because Ed Reed. Sorry, I was looking. I know you guys can't see everything. Ed Reed who I have and have pulled, is ungodly expensive. 1.8 million coins. 1.8 million coins for Ed Reed. He's never even on the block. The last one sold was 1.9 today. I think it's worth a shot. I think it's worth a shot. Do we do it? Do we pull the trigger, right? Do we are we going to do this? Let's do this. You know what? When there's a biscuit, sometimes sometimes you've got to risk it. Uh do we have a Micah Hyde already? I'd be surprised if I don't. And of course we don't. Um and I really hate paying 40k for his card. But. Should we wait? I think I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait maybe. Yeah. I'm going to wait. And I'm going to. I'm going to check the block. But in the meantime. I am going to. Get rid of Ed Reed. So if you guys would like. This Ed Reed, this exact copy of Ed Reed, he's going up on the block. He had a good run, and he was great. He was a great man, but the boys to men is playing in my head, and... Where are you, Edward? Right here. None. Up, there's none up. There's none up. 
He's going to go up. He's going up for 2 million coins. I kind of feel like I should do a little bit more than 2 million. Let's do a little. I, I, I would like to get 2 million back for him. And we'll see if he sells. Maybe he does, maybe he doesn't. If you guys happen to want an Ed Reed, yeah, because there's going to be one on the block. And he's up. He's up. I'm, I'm, I'm getting rid of my favorite card on my team to try this stupid Micah Hyde. But thank you for tuning in. I appreciate it. Uh, I hope this wasn't dumb. We'll find out. I'm CC and I'm out. Peace.